Good evening, Kitsap. It's been a while since I've done a video forecast, but I'm back to do some videos. Now, last night I was on the Outlaw Radio Network promoting forecasting Kitsap and the Kitsap Sun. These are social vigilantes. <laughs> it's a fun radio network for uh, the Kitsap Peninsula, and I don't know how often forecasting Kitsap will be on there, but every once in a while uh, I'll be doing a little bit of a, of a weather segment on the Outlaw Radio Network, so check it out, outlawradionetwork.com. And that's where you can see some forecasting Kitsap segments. Pretty fun stuff. All right, let's uh, take a look at some other headlines. La Nina is ending. The Climate Prediction Center, or CPC, has announced that around the equator, we got sea surface temperatures decreasing, or excuse me, increasing to about 0.5 degrees Celsius, which means we're going to be heading into a neutral pattern for summer. Here's all the cold air or water that's uh, left up here. But around the equator, we do have some neutral water, so that will mean kind of a neutral or normal summer weather pattern, as predicted a couple weeks ago. And this is kind of not a very pretty sight, is it? This is Anderson Lake from Port Hadlock. Commenter Alex sent some links to uh, some lakes around the area and also commented on how some shellfish businesses are opening late because of some sick lakes. So this is a problem. Well, what does this have to do with weather? I'm going to do a little bit more research on that because usually red tide and uh, lake problems with shellfish happen during warmer weather. And we haven't really had much warm weather. So I'll do some uh, information on that. If you have some input on why this is happening, feel free to comment. And I'll, I'll do some more research on that. Very good question. And that, that's really a bummer that that has to happen. Hopefully we can get that resolved. All right, here's the forecast for tonight. Mostly cloudy skies, showers. We will have increasing rain tonight. Lows will be in the mid-40s. Tomorrow we'll start out the day with rain. But then we'll kind of clear out to partly sunny skies. Highs will be in the 50s to lower 60s. And then here's a seven-day forecast. Besides the showers on Thursday, we have a pretty good stretch of warmer and drier weather. Highs in the mid-60s to low 70s. Bring back the showers from Monday. This was looking like a warm day. Now models are backing off. But we do warm a little bit back up for Tuesday and Wednesday and dry out. So take advantage of the weekend. Beautiful weather. Go sailing. Go uh, you know, walking in the park. Do whatever you need to do out in the and outdoors because it'll be a fun time to do it. There's your forecast. Stay tuned to Forecasting Kitsap and have a good evening.